Well, that felt good. Hey everyone, Gamer J Lee here, and welcome back to another video. And yes, yes, that just happened. I just deleted Halo 5 Guardians, and it feels good. It feels good to get rid of that game. It feels good because the truth is, is that for weeks, maybe even months, I've wanted to just get rid of Halo 5 Guardians. And you know, because people still wanted to see gameplay of it, I kept it on just in case. But I couldn't force myself to play that game any longer. And that's the God honest truth, is that the only time I felt good playing that game was either A, if I was playing SWAT, or B, if I was playing Team Snipers. And they got rid of Shy Snipers, so I can't even play a social playlist, so I have to play Ranked, and in Ranked, I'm super competitive, so it's not good for commentary. So. I just said screw it, I don't want to play this game anymore. I've played you know, enough custom games, I've played enough Forge, I've played enough this, I've played enough that, I don't want this game on my console anymore, you know? And I, I know a lot of people out there are going to be saying, you know, well this just proves that you don't care about the future of Halo. No, if it's going to be like this then fuck it. Because the truth is, is that I might have to move on. I might have to move on from Halo, and I hate doing that. Now, am I still going to do MCC videos? Hell yes. I love doing MCC. I just had one of my favorite videos done the other day with my best friend, and we had a great video which we just played Shrine for three matches, and it was a hell of a time. It was a hell of a lot of fun, but I'm not going to waste my time with a game that I don't enjoy. And one, all the updates are out for it. I don't think they're going to be getting any more kind of updates, even you know small ones. I don't really care for it. I don't want to like talk about the game. And if Halo 6 is going to be like that, then I'm just done. You know, it, it, that's just the truth. And I might have to move on from Halo and find something else to really get into because I'm not going to waste my life with something I'm not enjoying. You know, you know, like recently I started playing H1Z1 King of the Kill and Player Unknown Battlegrounds, and th those games are fun. Yes, they're like, you know, really luck based games and you know, they're they're kind of glitchy and buggy, but at least they're fun. At least I'm having a good time with my friends where I can't even force my friends to fucking play Halo 5. Like I'll say, hey, you know, I need to do a Halo 5 video, but I don't want to do it alone. Do you want to jump on and play with me? And they're like, no, I don't want to play Halo 5. Oh, you want to play MCC? Hell yeah, I'll play MCC. That, that's what they say to me. And it's just, it's just sad. It's, it's really sad because I... I want Halo to have a future, but with everything that we've heard so far, I don't think there is one. You know, I was really excited for Halo Wars 2, and I'm I still haven't finished the campaign because you know me and Matt are playing through it together uh, in our free time, and we just haven't had the time. You know, and the multiplayer is something I have to really learn, and I haven't like invested that time to learn it because it's not a bad game, but it's just. I'm not liking the direction right now. Like I'm, I'm kind of bored. You know, I love the classic Halos, but I can't force myself to play the new ones. And it sucks. It really sucks because I love playing Halo. I love, you know, letting you guys know about news that's going on. So I, I don't know what the future is with it. But you know, Halo Six is the last straw. If it's a complete another clusterfuck I'm done I'm not gonna waste my time or my money on investing into a game that I'm not gonna enjoy and if in the first week of Halo 6 being out whenever the hell that is and you know the game is complete another shit and it doesn't give us anything that you know classic players can enjoy as well as modern day players can enjoy then I'm just gonna delete that game too and then I'm gonna move on to something else you know, I'm going to move on to a game that I can enjoy and that I can really, you know, have a lot of fun playing because the truth is, is that what's the point in doing something if you're not enjoying it? 
and what I enjoy doing is making videos for you guys what I enjoy doing is creating content that you guys can share with me and you know go through these experiences together and if you agree with me then hey you know that's totally fine if you disagree with me hey I respect your opinion if you like Halo 5 and you like playing that game all the time then hey I respect that go ahead enjoy it but the thing for me is is when people go and they say well if you don't like Halo 5 then you don't care about Halo no, that's, that's not true. It's just that I don't like Halo 5. I care about Halo. I love Halo. I love the story of Halo. I love the universe of Halo. I love the community for Halo. I love everything about Halo. But I don't like Halo 5. And I don't find it fun. And that's the God honest truth. I'm spilling my guts for you guys. Because it felt so good to hit that uninstall button. And it just felt so good to see that icon disappear from my hard drive you know and that's that's the god honest truth is it felt good to get rid of that 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 tumor that was sitting on my xbox one and that's how it felt to me it felt like it was basically the plague sitting on my xbox and every time i would go to hit mcc or any of my other games it was sitting there and i would have to look at it and be like what a disappointment what a disappointing game that you were hurt and I want to delete you but I don't want to at the same time because I know people want to see me play this game but I just said enough is enough and that I'm gonna get rid of it and never touch it again you know th there's gonna be a very rare chance that I will ever touch that game again and it's not likely that I'll ever reinstall it because one uh, we've got the Scorpio coming out, you know, sooner or later, supposedly it's going to be announced this week. And, um, what's the point of me going back to that? But with MCC, you know, there's a lot of things you can do in MCC. There's a lot of fun campaigns you can play. There's a lot of fun side things you can do like multiplayer that is at least fun for me to do. You know, it's a lot more fun than doing Halo 5 where I just feel like there's nothing that's memorable with Halo 5 yes the forge is amazing in that game you know there's been amazing creations in in Halo 5 Guardians for forge and there are fun game types and custom games but the truth is is that I just couldn't force myself to play it anymore and am I gonna uninstall the PC version of Halo 5 yeah I most likely am because one they never fucking updated the thing they never gave it the FOV slider that they promised us. They never gave us the uncapped frame rate. And it's been mm, probably about a good six to eight months. And we still haven't gone shit. So, you know, I I'm just done. I'm done with Halo 5. They don't care about it anymore, and neither do I. So, alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like. If you guys are going to do the same exact thing, let me know down in the comment section down below. But as always, Gamer J. Lee signing out.